I really see big potential in this in this lifestyle galaxy, galaxy mining. Let me um, just unmute everyone. How are you doing, Justin? How are you doing, Adrian? All right. Yeah, was you on that call then just then? I was, yeah, yeah, very interesting, very exciting. Yes, you went, you went, in, you went into detail with the mining, obviously, with regards to Bitcoin mining. It probably went over a lot of people's heads. He did lose me at a couple of points, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but at the end of the day, you know, it's, um, I'm just trying to keep this simple, you know, it's just $25 for a mining package. It's as simple as that, you know. So, um, let me just mute Jonathan, who just come on, he's a lot, really loud background noise. Um, yeah, so where, where are you in regards to uh, Galaxy Mining? Yes, then, are you bought any mining packages or? Yeah, I've got, um, I've got a, a hundred and a fifty active. Uh, I'm going to do another uh, 500 next week. So you on the uh, call earlier, the first call? What's happened here now? I think you, you make a, you, you create an echo of some, of some kind. You got your you got your headset on. Have you got microphone on? Come on. Let me um, move just two seconds. Right, can you hear me now, yes, Tim? I can hear you, yeah, but uh, for some reason, the screen's going wild on me. Oh, I know a lot of background noise and from a few other people coming on. So, okay, let me see what's, uh, what's going on here. I'm just going to share my screen, show people what's going on here. What link are you using to um, to sign people up? Are you using your Dragon Mining link? I am, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I am. Uh, not having much luck at the moment, but then that's my fault because I'm not committed enough time to it at the moment. We've just had a funeral today, so um, that's up the way now. All right. Um, no, you're, so, not, you're not at an affiliate stage yet. You're at um, free member stage, yeah? No, no, I'm, uh, I am an affiliate. I've signed up. Just uh, need to put some... Well, put some good effort into it. I've got quite a few uh, prospects looking to uh, to sign up, uh, mostly offline, funny enough, rather than uh, online. Right. So I want to get out there and uh, put those in a bag over the weekend. Uh, also, I've got a little idea I'm playing with. I need to get some leaflets sorted. Yeah, I'm gonna get some leaflets done for this for Lifestyle Galaxy, Dragon Mining, Galaxy Mining. Uh, I, mean, um, I guess I'm, I'm going back onto the networking scene. I've joined, um, I forget what it's called, is it Federation? I've joined a company last week, £344 for a year. And they got, they got regular networking events every week, you know, in, in where I live, South Wales, and different, mainly within South Wales. I think it's called um, Fed FSB, or the Federation of, of Businesses. And um, they arrange all these sort of networking, sort of breakfast networks, you know, lunches, evening meals, all within that one, all that, you pay that, you make that one time payment of £147, pounds, that covers you for the year, and the, the events are free. So oh, gonna, I wouldn't mind, Adrian, if, um, if you could uh, share that information with me and then maybe come along with you, if uh, you fancy a bit of company. I've got my roll-up band. I don't even see my roll-up band in the background, can you? See that? You see the roll-up band there? Yeah. I got that done. And i got another, another one being made. As you, as you can see, I'm having another one being made. I'm having, and I'm going to be doing... Um, I'm going to be going on the road, going to these networking events, taking my roll-up banner with me. 
And uh, there's normally about 50, 60 people at a time in these events, at the, at the local events. But at the bigger events, then sometimes over 100 people. And, um, you know, it's tea and coffee, you know, some snacks, and uh, you're networking, you're exchanging business cards. But everyone I'm speaking to locally, sort of nobody's ever even heard of Bitcoin. So the sky's the limit, you know? Everything's, everything is a pretty, a, pretty easy, um, a pretty easy pitch, you know, people are interested. Yeah, I think I think people offline in networking events and just generally when you're in, like uh, I put a couple of posts, for example, on on Facebook. Yeah. And now when I go back to to West Wales to the rugby club, yeah. You know, first thing they'll ask me to come through the door. What's this Bitcoin about? So right. I <laughs> I have got quite a few of the boys interested in in, in it. So I think I'm probably getting more. Uh, interest offline that I am actually online because I'm not online enough, basically. You know, yeah, well, this, I gotta be honest, Tim. This may work better for you and, and a lot of people offline than online. I've, I've, done, I've done most of this online through all the Facebook groups, you know, and just adding friends and liking and commenting and, and building a, a trust with people and building a list. I've done it all online, but um. I'm pretty excited now about taking this offline and just, I'm gonna get some leafers done, about a couple of thousand leafers printed, double-sided. I've got a basic template in place with regards to Bitcoin mining. And um, I got my, I'm gonna get my second roller banner done. And then um, that's it really. I've got my, I'll probably get my business cards revamped. I've already got um, business cards, but these ones are pretty um, out of date. I've got a Bitcoin, I had these done a while ago with Bitcoin on the front. I photographed myself. You can see the Bitcoin logo there. I had these done ages ago, and a photograph of a car, my house, and um, on the back I had my property business. Yeah. So I had two double-sided, double-sided. I'd probably get these revamped and probably go up market. These are pretty cheap business cards. And then yeah, get some leaflets done, and then start um, going offline. And because um, it gives me something to do in the week as well, because my property business now is dying down. I had, I had 38 properties at one point. I've only got about 18 left. So, and three of them are going through, three of them are going through as we speak. So I'm slowly moving up to the property market. I'm probably going to keep about five or six just, just for the hell of it. They're not going to get rid of all of them. Are you going to sell those properties now through Bitcoin? Am I going to what? Are you going to sell them with Bitcoin? That's a good idea. I wish somebody would pay me in Bitcoin for them. I'd be happy to take Bitcoin for them if somebody's happy to... Um, Buy them from you, but I am really. That's a good point. Like, I, you know, <laughs> why not? There's always a first. There's, there are people starting to sell properties and accepting yeah. Bitcoin, isn't there? Especially there's been that, a, yeah, yeah. There's been a couple of large properties uh, showing up lately and uh, selling them for, for Bitcoin. Yeah, who's that famous girl, a Scottish girl? The she was famous for the bra, and she she's up in Dubai now with her the husband doing all Dubai properties selling for Bitcoin. That's right, yeah, I think that was the last one I saw, was it, to buy? She's got a, um, a real estate business, and she's accepting, you know, she only sells properties for Bitcoin. Well, I'd say, I was, uh, you know, the, the, the amount of people now looking to accept Bitcoin is just increasing by the day. Um, I was talking to our IT uh, guy in work, and he freelances and doing websites. And there's out of the five websites doing at the moment, two of them have requested Bitcoin buttons. Right. And funny enough, they're both motorcycle companies. Right. right. So that's definitely somewhere where I think they're uh, they're realizing that Bitcoin is the future. But was that in motorcycles? Yeah. Yeah. All oh, right. Was that in Wales or England or Scotland or? I I think they were actually Welsh. I've got to speak to him um, again because he he uh, he wasn't interested in doing Bitcoin himself, but he does see that it is something of the future because he's he's had a lot of people asking him about putting the payment uh, option on their websites. Right. Okay. So I'm. Uh, I'm in the process of finding out of him who they are to see if I can put an advert on their website. That's good, yeah. 
Yeah, that's good, good idea. There's that girl I'm talking about there. Um, that's the one, yeah, that's the one. She was mate. in Cardiff in, at, a, at a network, in the, she was last November, she was in Cardiff uh, at, at the Interviews event. Michelle Moan, she's Scottish. And she's just set up a company, a business in Dubai, a real estate. But she only accepts Bitcoin for, for the property purchases. So, yeah, it'd be, it'd be great to um, carry out um, a transaction with regards to... Um, the Bitcoin, but um, yeah, what I'm doing, I'm, I'm, I'm t moving out slowly, moving out of property. I'm, I'm looking for, uh, I'm going to keep a few properties, just keep my, a little, just a few there from an investment point of view. But um, everything for me now is, in, is going into Bitcoin and a, a number of other altcoins and um, obviously gold and silver as well. But and I've hit over, um, let me just bring up my app here, hold on. Um, let me just show you my stats, it's going to be crazy now. If Bitcoin price keeps going up. Um, well, I'm hoping it's not going to be a crash, I'm hoping it's not going to be a bubble, as people are saying, you know. There's talk they could all crash overnight, there's, a, there's that risk to it, don't get me wrong. But uh, that, that's, the, that's the risk we take, isn't it? You know, you know, don't put all your eggs in one basket, as they say. And um, spread your risk carefully. Well, my, 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 it's dropped from two point. It's dropped from two point eight three million to two point seven seven million. Crazy. So um, if it drops any further, you might have to start looking for a part time job, Adrian. Yes. <laughs> Well, I've got to be honest, I haven't, I haven't really done much for the last 10 years. I, I more or less reached semi retired in 2008 when um, the property market crashed. I went to Spain to live for two years, you know. And um, I haven't really done much since then. But um, I am really excited about the future of Bitcoin. It's going to, um, I think it's going to change a lot of people's lives, you know. That's the, that's the people who take action, don't get me wrong. There's no, it's, it's, a lot of people think it's too late. But um, I think Bitcoin will, will always be the number one, you know? Always be the number one. But you, you've got to take action, you know? Even if you just um, buy, a few, buy a few mining packages with, with, with uh, you know, Galaxy Mining right now, $25. You know, I, I know the packages are in stock with Genesis and SGG. When they come back into stock, you know, they have $30, obviously. But as you can see, I've got, um, I've got around $114,000 here in my Bittrex account in a number of different coins. So I do keep, um, I have got money in, in, a, in a few other altcoins. And um, This is my, um, let me share my screen. So there's my Bitrex account just logged in. I got $114,000 there. That's approximately 20 Bitcoin. In a number of different coins, including you know, Monero, Steam, Neo, GRS, BTS, Golos, Ripple. Couple of different coins here, got my money spread in. And um, what have I got in here? I got um, I, I use this Exodus wallet as an offline wallet, it's a bit more safe than online wallets. I also use a Trezor as well and, and a Nano. There you go, that's gone to over 2 million on that account there. That's a, mix, that's a mixture of Bitcoin. And a few other things. 